Hello friends, welcome back to Block Project in Laravel 10. Last video we have discussed about the how to create a slug. Means slug means inside how to make an active class. Suppose I am going to PHP tutorial, so he is showing the active class. Now also we have did like a linking about every place where we have did like a category name. So in this video we can continue same thing, but we need to work like a SEO part. Suppose we are going to home page, so here we need to change the title. After we need to change like meta title, meta description otherwise meta keywords because of php to laravel and javascript this is the three categories so category wise working very well suppose i am going to login so login also need to work very well like this suppose i am going to register so register also titles and meta description meta keywords need to do same thing we have other link like contact us about us like term and condition privacy policy this is the also we need to provide here and we need to do like this so how we can do it what is the best way so i can show you and I have another request, you are new inside error solution, otherwise in this series, so please subscribe and please press the bell icon. So whatever video we are uploading, so you can automatically get here notification and you can start immediately learning new things, okay? And suppose do you want to buy any scripts? So just go to errorsolutioncode.com and you can check a script menu and you can buy any script, whatever video we are uploading inside error solution, so you can get here, okay? So let's start now. So first of all, we need to log in as an admin, like a login and here we need to write like admin at the gmail.com. Suppose you are following this series, so you know what we are working here, okay? So once you can log in, so we need to create a here new menu, like a page menu. So when I click on the blog, so you can see it like a edit, delete, update. Also here you can see it like meta, article, meta descriptions, here is a description of our, so everything there. Same thing, we need to create a new menu, here is a blog. So how to work blog, I can explain everything. So means how to work page, I can explain everything. So let's start now and we can show. So first of all, you need to go to resources, views, inside backends, inside layout. Layout inside you can see it like app.blade.php. Once you can open app.blade.php, so inside you have concrete like a header files. So scroll down so you can see it. And also you can see it like a sidebar. So just go to sidebar and you scroll down. Here you can see it like a block. So just copy and paste the blog one. So you can see it, everything's just copy paste. And here we already work like a segment, how to work, how to make collapse. This is the all things is already clear. Just you can change like a block to page. Okay, very simple. And after you can save these files and just go back again, refresh the page like here. So you can see it here, new menu like a pages, you see, click on the pages. So here is a URL not found. So we need to create a URL. So first we need to create a URL. So first we need to do in our database like a blog.com, search blog.com. So inside you can see it here is a some table. So we need to create a new tables, like a table name is like a page. Okay, page. And what information we need means the inside column. So we need to add like a few rows here. First of all, we need an ID. Okay. Simple auto increment. Second one, we need a like a title. Where get 2255 nulls. Also, we need a description. Why need a description? Suppose you are doing the term and condition. So we need to use same thing. We don't want to create term and condition like another things. So just you can make like a long description here. Here you can pass like a null. Now next one is the meta title. Meta T I T L E. Second one is the meta descriptions. And after we can do it like a meta keywords. Next one is the like created at and updated at. Okay. So we can provide all the date and time here and here we can like two, five, five nulls, whatever do you want to like you can provide it. and here is a like a text you can provide sometimes people writing like big one. So we, I don't want to generate the issue, this results, where cares, two, five, five nulls and also here is a missing like slug, we need to add but right now no we don't add so just save after we can add a new column, I just save now. Okay, now I do is a new columns. So new column we need to do. So just go to titles, otherwise ID before you can go 
and you can do it here slug just worker uh, you can put like a worker 25 and nulls okay and save so this is the our table table created successfully now we need to do like a in our youtube channel inside sorry in our project inside we need to open your terminal and you need to create a one like a page models so just open your terminal and let's make zoom out so you can see it clearly so php artisan make model page model and just press the enter so it's taking few seconds and after creating don't worry about the warning this is the warning in my side your side you can't found like this warning because i have installed i magic tools this reason okay so you can see model successfully created you can see it here and is a bracket where is the created also you can show you the path so just you need to go to like app inside you can see model inside you can see page models so is a model is successfully created go to any models and just copy for the protected tables so just copy and paste here and you can put here the name of the page like a table name so is a page okay this work is done just close also here is a url set done close now i don't want to need this file also so i will also close now we need to create a routes so just go to web.php just scroll down so you can see it like a users there category there block there so let's copy for the blocks it's very easy and explanation okay just copy all the routes for the blocks now you need to change block to page so just copy and paste and here you can change also page and also you can change here page now we need to create a new models means new controller like a block control so http inside controller inside is you can see like block controller same thing we need to create a new control like a page controller so just you can go to again terminal and here you can clear and you can type php artisan make controller page controller whatever do you want to like you can group provide your name I just provide like a simple name PHP artisan make controller page controller so you can see it here is a page controller successfully created you can see it here okay so let's declare this controller now I can copy and I just change page controller so just go up and you can paste here and here you can see it page controllers okay so this is the done now we need to go to page controller and we need to create like page function add page insert page edit page update page and delete page but in this futures we don't want to need a delete page so just remove okay because the issue so what do you want to remove the delete one so how it works so we don't want to need delete one so remove the delete one just need to add and edits okay so let's go to block one block controller and you can copy all thing so I need to show everything like a clear way how we can do it. Just copy all things and you can paste inside page controller. Okay. Once you can paste here, so we need to change one by one. So let's comment out all things because one by one I will open the average function and I can show you how we can do it. So first our page. So just you can type page. Now we need to declare our model like a page models. So simple use app slash models slash page models. Okay. So page model inside we need to create a new function like a get records. So just copy and go to page models. Inside we can create static function get record. And here you can make like a very simple return. So return self self means is a class name page one so like just very simple i don't want to do here page ignition because you are create page like 100 page is a maximum no you only create 10 pages i can tell you like uh, contact us about us home page login register so you can maximum you can find out like a pages this pages we need to use for the seo and also we need to use for the 
like a description inside do you want to write any description so you can use it this reason i need to do like this so it's very simple and very easy okay so what do you want to add for this title like i go to our main website blog.com and so what do you want to change like this title like header title so you can do it inside pages so do you want to do this one so also you can do it inside pages so here is the only one article so also you can do it inside pages okay this reason i am doing also i need to make this the also dynamic but we have not put also dynamic so don't worry we can do it in next video for this dynamic like a home page we are clearing these times okay so let's refresh the page so you can see it here is the one error generated views not found like this there let's see and i need to sort out all the error about the views like a total not found why because of same file suppose i need to change like page dot list so just refresh the page so you can see it like another error like view backend page list not found like this error generates so how we can solve so simple just you need to go to views resources inside views inside you need to go to backends you can see views inside backends inside you need to create a new file uh, new folder like a pages and after we can create another file like a list.blade.php okay file successfully created you can see it so just you can go to blog inside go to list you can copy all things and just paste here i don't want to read page ignition so just remove the page ignition also i don't want to do like here totals because he is a made a totals so just remove the totals okay so just remove and uh, now is a uh, filtering there and here is uh, there are some informations uh, what we don't want to read images so just remove images let's refresh so you can understand what we have did so you can better understanding okay so we error generated so we can solve the errors so don't worry about that so refresh the page so you can see is open record not found and also here is a filtering there we don't want to need this filtering so just remove the filtering like a here like a form you can see it just remove and also we don't need hr so also you can remove now refresh the page so you can see like blog list and here she add new so just we need to change the title like a blog to page list okay and here we need to create a new routes like a page blog to page okay and here our database column name so let's go to back inside database so what what column we have add like slug so we always need a slug so we know where we can do it slug second is the title and third one is a, we can show you like a meta title other thing we don't want to show just you can edit and do okay after your decision do you want to show so you can show i don't think we need to show here this reason i can't show so just remove and create a date you can leave it and also you can leave it created times so id is there and also you can put slugs and here you can do it like a meta title t i t l e and everything you can remove other things and also i don't want to do delete button so just remove delete button and here edit page so we need to change block to page okay so everything is clear now let's go back and refresh the page so you can see it here is our clear everything like uh, slugs titles meta title keywords created dates and actions click on the add new so you can see it here is another function like found the error add page function not found so how we can sort out this issue just go to web.php inside you need to do like a you are already created like a panel page slash add so add page we need to create a new function go to page controller and here you can see it like a add block so just unco uncomment and you can change here like a add page we don't want to read here category just remove the category and we don't want to do like a data so just you can change like a path backend dot page dot add so we need to create a new file inside a page so new files save add dot blade dot php it's very simple and very easy now just go to block inside and you can copy all thing and paste here okay so now our next point we need to remove first like a category just remove the category let's go back again and we can refresh the page so you can see it here why we have category removed because of we don't need this reasons so let's go to back again generate the issue 
because of we have not saved this file okay page control dot php once you can save and refresh the page so you can see it's working very well okay now you can see it like a uh, titles description you can see it tag also you can see it publish and titles so we need to remove here some columns like images we don't need we need meta description we need meta keywords but we also need like a meta title publish and titles we don't need so it's very simple just go back again add page and you can remove the images remove the extra pages also because it's a code like a cleaning tag also no need so just remove and next point is the meta description meta keywords leave it and also we don't need like a titles and public sorry status and publish now we need to do like another let's here spelling mistake so solve this spelling mistake okay meta description also you can solve inside a blog inside so let's solve because we are working like a professional way so solve the error is good meta meta okay I think same thing is found in the edit because I just paste always copy paste work this reasons. So this is the like block time generate the error about this spelling mistake. So I was solve here. So it is a done. Now we need to add here is a meta titles. So just copy like a keywords one and you can put here and you can change like a meta keywords to meta title T I T L E and also you can change your titles. And also you can change here meta keywords to meta titles. Now we need to do here like a slug. We always need to provide like user can add his slug. So we don't want to need like a validation. So just remove the, all the validation, whatever validation he is provided here. You can leave it old. So for future do you want to use? So you can use it this reasons. So here is a meta titles, description, meta title, meta description, and meta keywords. Let's go back and refresh the page so you can see it like a clear way. So you can see title, descriptions, meta title, meta description, meta keywords for the SEO one and this is like a common one. So for future we need to use these reasons. Okay. Now we need to provide another thing like a slug. What is the slug? Slug meaning about like a which page. So I can type capital letter, the small letter slug. So we need to provide for this URL for the this page. Okay. So let's save and just go back again. Refresh the page. So you can see it like a slug. Also, you need to change like add new block to add new page. Just you can change like add new page. Okay. Now our next point here is action is equal to blank. So it's the same URL. Here is a putting. So what we can do, we need to create another post method. So already done post method, you can see it. So we need to create a new function inside page controller, like an insert record, insert page. So just uncondition means uncomment. Sorry, edit one we don't need. So just make again uncomment means comment out and we can do like slug we don't need. So remove the slugs. Also, we don't want to do like images. So removing also we don't want to do like a tag. So removing. So now you can see like user ID we don't need. Just remove here. We need to do like another one slug. So just add slugs. And also you can do it here slug category ID don't need so leave it and publish status we don't need so just remove and also we can do it like a meta title just copy and paste and you can change here like a meta title T I T L E and also you can change here okay and here you can change like a page successfully created and also you can do it like a panel page list and also you can change here like a page models so insert page is a dance you can see it now okay let's go back and we can refresh the page and we can try is working not working so our first task is home okay so i just make like home also i can make description home home slash blog other we can do it like home home also you can put like a homes and i click on the submit so you can see page six will created easy and easy Slug is a home, title is equal to home, meta title is a home blog and is a created dates. So this is the page creation working very well. Same thing you can do it like here like a login. So you can do it like login. Okay. And here also you can do it login, login dot blog, whatever website name you can put it here. This reasons and here I can put same thing. 
whatever do you want to like this is the your decision and you can do it like a logins okay this is the your point you can do it your end but i just show you how we can use for slug wise i can explain like a next video but in this video we can cover inside admin panel works now we are last point available like edit points suppose click on the edits so you can see it here is another error method page controller inside edit page does not exist means is a controller inside this function not found so just go to back again and we can make uncomment for these files and here you can see it like edit page means edit block so just you can change like edit block to edit page we don't want to get categories so just remove and we need to change here like block to page and here also you can change like a block to page now we we need to create a page model inside need to create a new function like get single so very simple and very is a static function get single here is the one parameter we have passed so this is the parameter and we return self and get sorry find direct you can use find and here you can pass like a id find means self means this class name other do you want to use like this so also can work whatever do you want to like same thing you can do it like this here also can work whatever do you want to like you can use it okay so here is done let's remove the list file leave it like add new pages and leave it like a page controller now we need to create another file inside a page like edit.blade.php so just create a new file edit.blade.php now you need to go to add.blade.php file inside and just copy all thing and paste here and just you can change the title edit page let's go back again refresh the page so you can see it is working not working so it's working very well you can see it like edit page slug titles meta title meta description meta keywords so first of all we need to show like our old data like you are editing so you know this id and this id again we have made here is a query like getting the first record whatever there so we need to show here so simple way just you can prove an inside value what variable inside we have passed like a get record just copy and you can put it like a very simple way get record slug our database column is a slug so just you can do is a database column wise because i have made same column every place this results look like a same thing like here you can put like a titles t-i-t-l-e just copy and paste and you can do it here descriptions also you can copy paste here means copy and just you can change here like old to this ones also you can change here after we can change inside a parameter like here is a meta descriptions and here is a like a get a meta keywords and also you can do it here like a meta titles okay so it is done let's refresh the page and we can check it is working not working i just go back again refresh the page so you can see it every data is a found like home 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 block home home and home you can see it here okay so this is the working very well now just our condition here just need to update so very simple just you can go back again and you can see it is the action url action url is a blank so what action url like a same url like a all url so what we can do same url get method so we just need to do same as a post method so we have already done here you can see it so just copy this function name and you can go to page controller and just you can make uncomment all and you can do it like a update page and here we can change like a page model and this is the function edit time we have created so same function we can use here and you can you can see it here is id so just copy above one and paste here and you can remove rest of everything so you can see it here okay now just we can change here like a panel to page and he can change here like a block to sorry block to page and here also you can change like a block to page just you can save these files and just go back again and refresh the page and just click on the update function let's make a like a home title is equal to one and here also you can make like a one and press the enter so you can see it here is the updation working very well so i don't want to do like this stupid way so just we can make proper way ohms also we can do it like a here's the ohms 
so you can see it like a slug title meta title and meta keywords and like a title descriptions everything we have done inside the pages so in this video i have explained like a how to create a pages inside a admin panel next video we can do it like a dynamic so but how to change this words how to change this ones login one register one so how many login we ever did slugs so we need to add another slug for the register one so register slug we can do like forget password we can do reset password we can do also you can go to like a bottom contact us about us term and condition privacy policy everything we can short out here and after i can show it here so i hope you have a clear now everything how to we can how we can do it okay and do you have any question so please comment inside the uh, videos and i will give you the answer and i hope you can enjoy and i have again request you are new in the channel or in this series so please subscribe and please press the bell icon so we can try to our best and we can upload more and more videos and uh, you know our personal website errorsolutioncode.com so, so do you want to buy scripts just go and buy and thank you for watching error solution